Hi there, Kevin Clerks reporting from Abraham Lake here in Alberta. It's in the Rocky Mountains, as you can see behind me here. Uh, I'm just going to give you a brief history. Abraham Lake is in memory of Silas Abraham, a stony Indian from Morley, Alberta. Uh, this was their hunting ground and their burial site and everything else. Uh, the Abraham Lake, which you can see out there, is 20 miles long, covers an area of 13,700 acres, and provides one storage for 1,165,000 acre feet of water. It has a low operating level of 4,206 feet and a full supply level of 4,335 feet. Uh, storage season is from June to August. And the withdrawal period is from October through May. It was started in 1969 and completed in 1972. Now it says, uh, prior to the flooding of Abraham Lake, several Indian grave sites and cabins were moved to locations. Uh, some were not, which they don't mention there. But, as a thank you for providing us with the land to build the lake. We, the white people, out of the goodness of our hearts, presented the good people who used to live here and hunt here and buried their dead here with that that you see down below a giant steel teepee so we're going to walk down to the giant steel teepee and you can see Abraham Lake in the background there or Lake Abraham whichever way you want to say it now they say that this area is still haunted with the spirit of some of the Indians who were buried here or whose graves were moved from here. And if I can get down to it, the uh, giant steel teepee. We'll tell you about the giant steel teepee first. Uh, to the people of the Stony tribe who were living on these plains when the first man, white man arrived, this area is the ancestral home and a source of spiritual and cultural strength for the Stony people. Uh, this was dedicated in 1973. They have found their peace with the Great Spirit while we who live on still search for justice and peace in the land of our forefathers. Interesting thing to say on a dedication to people whose land you just took from them. But anyway, here is Abraham Lake. Beautiful lake. Now originally when it was built, they had planned to use it for recreational purposes. But then, after building it, they discovered it was too dangerous to have boats on because of the winds that come down off the mountains. Now, as I was saying about the haunting of spirits, this uh, teepee is said to make a, a banging noise. Now, science would tell us that that's the sun causing it to expand and contract and making noises, but the myth is that it's the dissatisfied spirits of the uh, Indians who were laid to rest here coming back to remind people that this was their home. It's up to you which you believe. So anyways, 
Here is Abraham Lake, which goes all the way that direction. And then the, we can kind of go over this way. There's a, there's a sort of small dam over there, but it's not interesting really. The, there's another dam right over there. And after here, I'm going to drive over there and see what's on the other side of that ridge. I imagine it'll drop fairly far down. But anyways, this is Abraham Lake in Alberta in the Canadian Rockies. Al Abraham Lake is located just west of Nordic, Alberta. Uh, if you can't find Nordic on the map, look for Rocky Mountain House. Then look to the west of that. And... Uh, if you find a place called The Crossing, you've gone too far. It's actually um, closer to Nordic, but it's in between those two points. Anyway, gotta go. Somebody's coming. Have a great day. Kevin Cook's reporting from Abraham Lake. Bye for now.